so this, this playground is administered by a little committee and we have a problem that the surface needs to be replaced every few years because it gets flat and it also sort of disappears and as a small committee we have a lot of problem we have to fundraise the money that we need and I was told about um, area grants so that was fantastic so for this surface we I think we had to apply for a grant for about £800, which was matched funding. It cost about £1,600 altogether. So £800 was a grant, which was wonderful. We were able to raise the other six, the other eight, our part of it, the R800. And um, we put a new surface down, which, which is one of the most important things when we have our safety inspections. The, um, the depth of the, of the safety surface is very important. And our other problem was that we were rather short of equipment and we wanted some more and we discovered that we could apply for a grant for about a thousand pounds for a single piece of equipment and with that we managed to put up this bit of equipment and it's been great because because the range of play opportunities here was rather limited and this definitely appeals to the slightly older children the sort of six to eleven bracket and it's just meant that the playground is, is more interesting for the children in the village and they do come here and play a lot, they can come on their own, the older ones, the younger ones tend to come with their parents and their grandparents and we're delighted and to be honest without it we might have been in a position where we had to think about closing the playground so we were thrilled to get the area ground. We're standing in what is going to be um, a community room but also the main room for the pavilion for the use of the uh, sporting teams that will use the, the facilities here. Um, we also have a brand new kitchen, um, toilets and new changing facilities. Um, and the whole building um, is completely new. It was to replace our completely dilapidated um, old sports pavilion that was wooden and had been built in the 1950s and was um, Sadly, um, an attraction for vandals, and we decided about eight, nine years ago that um, it should be replaced. And it's taken that time to get all the money together and the plans together. But uh, one of the vital contributions that we had was a contribution from the area board, the South West Wilts area board, in the sum of thirty-two thousand um, pounds. And it's and it's gone towards this rather splendid building that everybody is very proud of. Biggest difference, of course, is that the Wilton community as a whole has um, a new facility um, to be used by sports teams, the local football club and the cricket clubs. And the community can also use the big room that we have here. Um, anybody from toddler groups, parties, birthday parties, um, brownies, scouts, uh, elderly people. Um, we also will have the use of the um, meadow outside when that's been regraded and levelled um, and the football teams and the cricket club are absolutely delighted. Their facilities now comply with their Premier League requirements um, and they're looking forward to using it um, when it comes back fully into commission. But um, certainly the community is available, it's available to the community to hire us from now.